Good evening and welcome back to Live at 5. I'm Trey Tonneson and right now in Searcy it's about 65 degrees and clear but like I said over the next few hours that will change. Up in the northern portions of the state as you can see a, a cold front and a low pressure system is already moving into the state dropping temperatures in Fayetteville to the 30s and that'll be here before you know it. In Little Rock right now 62 about the same in White County but once again those are going to drop. And as we look across your surface map, as you can see all the way up into our state, you see plenty of action there over the state, which is going to drop the temperature and bring just a little bit of moisture over the next 24 hours. But as you can see, that's pretty significant because of the amount of rainfall we've already received up in areas such as Jackson County and on into White County itself. As we look across your surface map for tomorrow, you can see a wintry mix moving into the state from the northwestern portions of the country, dropping a little bit of snow and sleet on the Midwest on its way into our state. And across the state tomorrow, the high is significantly lower uh, in the 40s in the far northern portions of the state. And as we move into the southern portions of the state, it gets up in the warm portions of the 50s. But as we move across your surface map into your Friday surface map, you can see the low pressure system will move out but once again, it will drop temperatures and that'll bring just a little bit of rainfall to make road condi conditions a little bit dangerous and slick as you make your morning commute to work. And it may be even be around as you come home from work and pick up your kids. And we want to introduce something a little new here. Uh, this day in weather history across the state, we saw record baseball size hail in White County. Little Rock and Searcy registered that and we saw 19 inches in areas such as Nebraska and on into North Carolina where there was five to six feet of rain. That's a little bit significant as we'll see a little bit of rain tomorrow once again. Friday the rain will move out but it will move in again Saturday bringing temperatures up to about 55 degrees. Could be between 55, 58, 59 degrees. As we move into Sunday the rain will return. The temperatures this time significantly lower. Maybe you could see a wintry mix course right here as the temperature is predicted right now currently around 37 to 40 degrees but as the system moves in it could drop it a little bit the reason for that being the quick nature of this low pressure system could drop a little bit of wintry mix once again bringing your road conditions to the dangerous level so keep that in mind but that system will move out on Monday but the temperature is still down in the 30s so this temperatures you're getting used to spring is not here quite yet but next week after this low pressure system moves on temperatures will rise again but for now that's all we have at the weather center we're going to send it back to the desk with Michaela and Dylan